Also breaking in just the last 15 minutes, a judge reissued a bond for a man accused of raping and killing a Charlotte woman. Uh, Robin Kennedy was inside the courtroom. Robin, what is the latest? Raphael Wright Jr. is heading back to jail after Judge Reggie McKnight said that his initial bond of 50K was not appropriate. The judge making that ruling just moments ago. Take a look at here in the courtroom as the deputies are snapping those handcuffs back on to Raphael Omar Wright Jr. He was arrested at the end of June for first degree murder and first degree rape. The jail records show that not even 24 hours later, he was released from the Mecklenburg County Jail. Judge Jennifer Fleet only gave him a $50,000 bond, so he was able to bond out. Wright was charged with raping and killing a woman in June on Glenwood Drive. Charlotte Mecklenburg Police Chief Johnny Jennings said at the time, disappointed, didn't even begin to describe how he felt about that low bond. Now, it appears Wright is claiming self-defense in this case, but police say there is no proof of that. Court documents say he says he met the victim through an escort service at a Charlotte hotel and that someone else hid out in the bathroom and attacked him and pointed a gun at him and he shot back. That's when the victim was shot and killed. But police say there is no surveillance video of anyone else going in and out of that hotel room other than right at the time the victim was killed again. Right, heading back to jail just moments ago. Deputies handcuffed him, and he now has an $850,000 bond. He's being held in the Mecklenburg County Jail. I'm live at the Mecklenburg County Courthouse. Robin Kennedy, Queen City News.